Hello everyone, I'm Cynthia Ann and this is our dog Loki. Thanks for joining us for this pasta salad. So it is a beautiful day here in Kalamazoo, Michigan. We're able to open windows. People are out cutting branches that have fallen over the winter. It's just a gorgeous day. So it made me think of making a pasta salad for picnics and I just can't wait for spring and summer to be here. So this is a um, salad that I actually send with my husband for lunch quite often and it's packed full of vegetables and nutrition. So let's head to the kitchen and I'll show you what I put together. Okay, for this pasta salad, I always use tri-color rotini because I just find that the presentation of it is just so much more colorful in a pasta salad. So that's why I use that. And then I have also discovered a nice little surprise. I have been using these um, imitation bacon bites for years because of being so frugal and they're cheaper than real bacon bites. And I found out that they're actually a vegan product and they're soy based. So, so that's kind of cool. And I also have made my own lemon vinaigrette dressing for this salad, but you can add any Italian dressing or any type of dressing you want for it. Italian dressing goes best, and this is uh, like an Italian dressing, but lemon vinaigrette with oregano in it, and I will put the recipe down below for you if you'd like to make this dressing as well. Um, and of course, we're gonna be adding a lot of vegetables to make this very nutritious. So let's get started with some parsley that I'm going to be um, adding into it. And this is something that you can put um, a small amount, a lot of, it depends on your taste when it comes to parsley, if you're a parsley fan or not. Um, but Brian personally likes parsley, so I add quite a bit into his uh, pasta salad.
have it. A pasta salad that can be packed for lunches for days, depending on how many people live in your household. <laughs> but this is one of our favorite go-tos, and as you can see, it's packed full of nutrition. Between black beans and sunflower seeds and all of the um, vegetables that I've added, this is a very nutritious, satisfying lunch. dressing. It's a variation that um, I found a while back, um, but I love making my own dressings now. My sister's been making them for years and I've just never thought to make them and they're so easy. So check out my recipe down below and you can tweak it, you can add different things, but basically a lot of the Italian dressing recipes are simply oil and vinegar and then seasonings. That's it. It's pretty easy to make. Of course, this one, being a lemon vinaigrette, there's tablespoons of lemon juice in here. Mm, mm, mm. I love this pasta salad. This is definitely another party for my taste buds. It's so colorful. I feel like it's like a confetti salad, but I already made a confetti salad before, didn't I? So this is definitely pasta salad with lots of vegetables. So keeping it colorful, adding more vegetables, less pasta, um, that way it just keeps the nutrition value very high. So the fact that it's gorgeous here in Michigan and we don't have that very many sunny days in March, I'm going to go outside and eat my pasta salad and get some vitamin D, much needed vitamin D in the state of Michigan. So I hope you're having some great weather wherever you are. Until next time, take care.